segment. I watch it online too when I miss it because I adore Gabe Sagley and he always has such great deals. One I'm very looking forward to. Okay, all right. There you go, Gabe. Uh, well, listen, this is the whole idea, the whole idea, guys, of a segment like this, which we've been doing on this show for more than a decade now, is to inspire you, right? To show you what's out there and how just by cashing in on a, a couple of uh, extra vacation days, the world is at your fingertips. Now, this first. Uh, getaway, I think, is on everybody's to-do list. We've heard about Iceland. We've heard about these northern light tours. Um, and uh, why not see it in person? This is a great deal that's made possible in part because, and in large part because, you've got these new low-cost international carriers. Okay, this is an airline called WOW. Uh, it's based in Iceland, in Reykjavik. Uh, and they're really sort of uh, forcing a lot of the big players to bring airfare to Europe down. And then you're getting these packages priced like this. This is $6.99. It's airfare out of SFO. But it's $6.99. You fly over to Reykjavik, Iceland, and you spend... Um, Three, three nights there, you get to hang out in that city, great nightlife there in Reykjavik. There's a Northern Lights tour included. Uh, and again, great price point at $6.99. Uh, and then you come back after, you know, four days, and then you've, you've been able, you can say on your list, hey, look, I've been to Iceland, check out my cool photographs, look at my Instagram account, so cool. Um, anyway, another to-do list item checked. Now, where I was earlier this week, another international destination, Canada, Vancouver. I love Vancouver, one of the prettiest cities in North America. And boy, the value there is huge because uh, the Canadian dollar is really weak against the U.S. dollar now. So you're getting these great hotel deals, uh, eating and, and, and uh, drinking and, and having a good time there is just that much more affordable. This is the Moda Hotel in Vancouver, close to the entertainment district, walking distance with some of the great landmarks and attractions there, 76 a night. This is a chic four-star hotel. $76 a night in the heart of downtown, breakfast included uh, for travel throughout the winter season. So take advantage of the low season, the low Canadian dollar, and uh, a great little Canadian getaway is at your fingertips. Now, who doesn't like a little Sin City? You know, you save a lot of money. You pack a little bit of luck, and then you can have a great time there in Las Vegas. I'm going to show you where to stay and what to do at under $100 total. How about the Palms Resort Casino? Uh, this is a very celeb-friendly hotel just off the Strip. They have that great two-acre pool complex, the IMAX 3D theaters, some great um, uh, nightlife action here as well. And they, the Strip is just down the way. $29 a night to stay at the Palms Resort Casino. Did he just really say 29 uh, Yes, 29 bucks a night. That's for travel all the way through May. You've got to pick your dates. It's usually midweek dates. Avoid weekends and conventions uh, when they come to town. 29 bucks there. And then what do you do in the evening? Uh, the last show I saw in Vegas a few weeks ago was this one. Great show, Penn and Teller. Uh, that they, they performed there at the Rio All Suite Hotel there right on the Strip. Considered one of the best shows, one of the best magic shows in Sin City. Uh, and um, we've got on our entertainment section on the Travel Zoo website, tickets to Penn and Teller from, be, from about $46 to $56 per seat. Seats that usually go between $80 and $90. So you're saving about 40% on these seats. Uh, I suggest the main floor seats. That's where I sat on the main floor. Very intimate theater there. The action is, I mean, you can't miss it. And after the show, both Penn and Taylor hang out in the lobby for selfies until everybody's gone. So uh, the show continues after the show is done there in the lobby. Anyway, a couple of options for you, um, no matter where you want to go. And we've got more after the top of the hour. They just hang so out in the lobby? You just hang out with Penn and Teller? That's cool. They, they're famous for, and because I, I got selfies with both, uh -huh. uh, once the show's done, everybody just kind of comes around, and then the line forms, and they will literally take selfies wow. with everybody who's there until the very last uh, guest is, uh, is gone. I want to be cool. in Gabe's family. Cool. They travel all the time. They really do. They really do. <laughs> we do have a link to Travel Zoo at GoodDaySacramento.com. All right, status update.